Yes, mate. Can you put two new tyres on the front, please? Sure. hopeless with computers. I'm, I'm totally clueless. I wouldn't know a website if it got up and smacked me in the face. I know exactly what you mean. I know. I'm the same with video recorders. Oh. I cannot program Worse. one to save my life. Uh, video recorders? Isn't that? I can't even barely turn my TV on. Oh, you're lucky I can't even find my telly. <laughs> it's pitch black in my house. I can't use light switches. I don't know how to do it. No, no. You're lucky you can get into your house. I'm terrible with keys. I've oh. never got the hang of them. Never. Uh, I'm the same. With, I like? can't even find my house. I, don't, oh. I can't use numbers. How does that all work then? What's like? that about? What are we like? Oh. <laughs> Drinking, oh. I never, never got the hang of it. No, I can't even remember. Oh, 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 easy, you see. Oh, oh, never really got my head round. I don't no, know how it works. Like, like, I don't it. know. And it must go. Okay. See you later. Oh, black. Oh. <laughs> Not still looking for a job, are you, Tim? Yeah, I am. Yeah, and there's quite a few possibles. Yes. Oh, here's one. Person wanted to put crosses through newspaper adverts. <laughs> no, that's not me. <laughs> my little customs officer. <laughs> Thank you, love. Did you pack this present yourself? Yes. <laughs> now, have you left this present unattended at any time? I just left it in the kitchen for a couple of minutes before you came in. Any electrical appliances? Not this year, dear, no. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, and I've got another surprise present for you, but I'm not going to tell you where it is. Excellent. <laughs> no. I don't like that new town cry. Where's he from? I think he's from Liverpool. Harry! Harry! <laughs> Ronnie, have you been temping bowling tonight? Yeah, I have. How did you know that? You've still got your bowling shoes on. You idiot. How did he manage to forget that? It's not hard, is it? When you start, you hand in your shoes, they hand you the bowling shoes. And then when you finish, you hand back the bowling shoes and they hand you back your shoes. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> oh, Jim. I've just been to this amazing place where, through genetic seeding, they can produce a totally unique flower. And that's what this is. It's a completely new species. I've actually got it named after my wife for her birthday. It cost me a £1,000. She'll love that. That's so romantic. What's your wife's name again? Rose. <laughs> Hi. How are you? Oh, wow, you look fantastic. It's amazing. How do you do it? Well, I'm on the special blood tight, low carb diet of steamed vegetables and fish. I do two hours of high impact Pilates every day and an hour's kickboxing session every other day. Transcendental meditation, of course. I make sure I only sleep from 9 p.m. to 4 a.m., but I do power nap every 15 minutes between my workouts and my sessions with my aura cleansing energy channeling therapist. So. Blimey. <laughs> no wonder you look so good. Mind you, I mean, you look fantastic. How do you do it? Um, I enjoy life. <laughs> Good 
Get out. <laughs> Pull your back. <laughs> he taught me to yodel, yodel, loadle, loadle, yodel, loadle, loadle, ladle, loadle, loadle, ladle, loadle, yodel, loadle. Hold on a minute. What are you doing? That's not yodeling. Well, that's what I had written on the lyrics. No, that's just how it's written down. Yodeling's, um, it's like a high-pitched warbling from the back of your throat, like... <laughs> hmm. All right, well, I'll give it a go. <clears throat> <clears throat> he taught me to yodel, yodel, loadle, loadle. Woohoo! <laughs> I completely agree with you. I'll have a word with him. <laughs> False alarm! <laughs> you know they've invented a game now so blind people can play cricket. Have they? Pardon? <laughs> that makes sense. Oh, yeah. All right, what about this? You know they've invented a game now so blind people can play cricket. Have they? <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> OK, Mr Tamara, can you tell me how many dots you can see on this piece of card? 17,653. <laughs> Wrong. Four. But I'll tell you what, you can't half count quick. <laughs> See you tomorrow, then. Oh, no, I'm not in tomorrow. Are you not? No, day after tomorrow. Oh, well, I'll see you then. It'll be a day after tomorrow, won't it? Well, I'll see you then, then. <laughs> see you Friday. Oh, no, cos Friday's Good Friday. Oh, so when will I see you then? Oh, Saturday, Sunday. Monday's bank holiday. Monday is bank holiday. So I'll see you Tuesday. See you Tuesday. All right, bye. bye. Oh, no, Tuesday, we're all off. Oh, so Wednesday, Wednesday, I'll see you Wednesday. Yeah, it won't be till Wednesday, will it? <gasps> Wait, tomorrow. Oh, what a long time. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no, cos I'm off on holiday on the Wednesday. Oh, when do you get back? 13th. <gasps> all right. Bye. Bye. Oh, no, I'll finish work on the 12th. Oh, I'll never see you again. No. Then. Oh, bye, bye. <laughs> And welcome to the World DJ Slam Championships! Well, there you go, ABC there in the Look Up Love, taking us all the way back to 1983. Come on, I want to hear you. It is Look Up Love! Right, we've got a girl in tonight, she's called Belinda, and apparently it's her 18th birthday, so we want to see her on the floor tonight with all the other virgins waving their knickers in the air tonight. Oh, yes, scream if you want to go faster, girls. This one is Rio. Yeah. <laughs> Right, we've got a Ford Sierra in the car park. The registration is X95. You've left your lights on. You don't want to get a flat battery, do you? I'll tell you something that wasn't flat. Heaven, a 17. <laughs> No, well, we're about to take off, so I'll call you back. All right, bye. God, mobiles, eh? Can't live with them. Can't stop them ringing. I wouldn't know. I haven't got one. You haven't got a mobile? You haven't got a mobile? Well, you're a bit of a one-off. So I expect people just page you, do they? I haven't got a pager. You haven't got a pager? You haven't got a pager? Well, mind you, just email people on your, on your laptop, do you? No, I haven't got a laptop. You haven't got a laptop? You haven't got a laptop? What are you playing video games on? You haven't got any video games? <laughs> How do you relax? Well, I try to read the paper. Besides, don't you find all this technology gets in the way of things? Like what? I don't know, friendships. I wouldn't know, I haven't got any friends. <laughs> you haven't got any friends? You haven't got any friends? Still, leaves you more time for your family. I haven't got a family. You haven't got a family? You haven't got a family? Still, at least you've got your health. <laughs> Still, there's more to life than health. I haven't got a life. You haven't got a life! <laughs> you haven't got a life! 
What have you got? Got a mobile. <laughs> You wouldn't bring your work home with you. <laughs> oh, I really don't have the shoes for this. <laughs> Excuse me, did you phone us? Did you phone us? Did you phone us? Oh, you're the breakdown service. Sorry, yes, I did phone. It sounds like something metal's rattling round inside the engine. <laughs> what are you on about? Well, are you going to look under the bonnet? What do you mean, the bonnet? The big thing at the front. Is this your first day? There's nothing there. Well, you won't know till you've looked, will you? Are you feeling okay, sir? I'm a fully paid-up member, you know. <laughs> OK, I'll have a little look for you. Oh, look! There's a spanner in there. Let's have a look. I can't see. Oh, yeah, I've been looking for that. <laughs> Enjoy the rest of your journey, sir. Oi! Spanner. <laughs> Excuse me, it won't stop. Look. <laughs> Just you making a funny noise with your mouth. <laughs> there's nothing I can do for you. So there's no way you can get this car to start. No. Well, you know what that means, don't you? I'm a premier member. You have to take me home. Carlisle, please. <laughs> <laughs> Oi, egghead. Who are you calling egghead? No, not you. Him. <laughs> I know I ain't no great success story. Look at me. What am I, a tubby private dick who spends half his time dodging the bullets, the other half dodging the law? Yeah, sure. I ain't no superhero. OK, so I smoke too many cigarettes and I drink too much bourbon. And you stink. OK, so I ain't no bather. I can't afford fancy cologne or a fancy place to live. But I do have a place, a place in my heart, and that place is for you. Yeah, sure. I ain't no great shakes. I haven't got much money and I don't have the fancy car. And you're ugly. OK, so I don't look like a movie star and a guy I know we're all bums. So I spend too much time in a speakeasy with a low lives and a mop. But I love you, doll, and that's got to count for something. Ain't it? Ain't it? Yeah, sure. If I was you, I'd walk away. I know what I am. A guy would have the fancy shoes and the fancy looks. And you wet the bed. OK, so I squirt a little. But I'll tell you something, I love you, doll, and that's got to count for something. If I was you, I'd walk away. I know that, but I'm telling you something, doll. you got to know this. I love you like a guy I never loved a woman before. Yeah, sure, I'm not a poet. I don't speak like a guy with all the fancy words. And you Oh, why don't you get stuffed? <laughs> the end. There we go. It's finally finished. OK. Let's have a look, Ben. Uh -huh. Black satin sheets. Oh, come on, Karen, show some imagination. A lot of people like that. It's very romantic. If you say so. Ceiling mirrors. What? Tacky. Oh, go, give me a break. Read on. OK. Leopard skin rug. I know what I like. Oh, Karen, nobody's going to get this. Shut up, will you? That took me ages to finish and you've just picked it to pieces. I just think you should get a boyfriend before you write your wedding list. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. All right. You busy? Do you want a burger? Yeah, go on, have a burger, yeah. Thanks. And cheese? Yeah, go on, have some cheese, yeah. Onions? Yeah, go on, have some onions, yeah. There you go. Thanks a lot. Are you busy? Nah. Do you want to blow my whistle? <laughs> Hello, can you hear me? Yeah. yeah. Now, you know why we're here today, don't you? Your voice will be an integral part of our overall improvement of the London Underground. 
So let's make a start, shall we? You should find the script in front of you. Yes, I've got it, thanks. I'll guide you through it, but mm -hmm. any problems, let me know. I think you should find it's fairly straightforward. OK. So here's the first one. Finchley. Finchley. A bit more bold and definite, if you will. Finchley. Excellent. So let's do all the Finchleys now. East. East. West. West. And Central. Central. Now, if you could just give me Clapham, North, South. Clapham, North, South. Common. Common. Tart. 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 <laughs> Very good. Now, if you could just say, this train terminates at... This train terminates at... Morden. Morden. High Barnet. High Barnet. Edgware. Edgware. Spreadham. Spre Spreadham? <laughs> it's very definite on that one. It's the end of the line. Spreadham. That's more like it. I haven't heard of that station. OK, I... moving on. <laughs> Let's see you say, this train is for... This train is for... Elephant and soapy lather. <laughs> Elephant and soapy lather. I can't say that. It's fine. It sounded good. Now, wood green. If you could emphasise the wood on that. Wood. Wood green. Bank. Bank. A bit more on the ank. Ank. <laughs> Upminster. Can you stress the up? Upminster. The Oval. The Oval. Arsenal. Arsenal. I'm not sure about this. We're on the home stretch now. Hackney Wick. Hackney Wick. Shepherd's Bush. Shepherd's Bush. <laughs> Just one more thing. Cockfosters. <laughs> It's on the Piccadilly line. Mmm, <laughs> this looks yummy. You're going to make Mummy proud and have a nice big spoonful? <gasps> Are you aware you were doing 40 miles an hour and a 30 mile an hour limit, sir? It's my job. <laughs> <laughs> It's a chihuahua pedal. <laughs> Don't go in there, there's a wasp. <laughs> I see you're admiring my butterfly collection. Collection? We've only got one. Well, it's actually harder than it looks, stabbing a butterfly with a pin. <laughs> I can't go. Sorry? I can't go with someone standing next to me. Well, I'll be finished in a minute. Oh, hang on. I think I'm going now. <laughs> yep. Yes, I am. Good. Oh dear, I've stopped. Can you come back, please? <laughs> Just can you come back and stand next to me? Only I think strange it was having you there that made me go. <laughs> Lovely weather. Right. <laughs> Nearly done. There. Oh dear, hang on. I think I need a poo. What time's this new boss of yours getting here? Should be here in a minute. Hey, what's she like? You know the type. No coat, fur knickers. <laughs> the expression is, fur coat, no knickers. 
Thank you for calling. Your call is being held in a queue and will be answered shortly. Mr. Tarre of Her Majesty's Customs. Yes. We're from the CID. We have reason to believe you've been pilfering from the airport. I don't know what you're talking about. You better come in. <laughs> Turn over and action. And then you said those four magic words, will you marry me? I just couldn't believe it. I remember the look on your face. I thought you were going to faint. It seems like yesterday. I know. Where does the time go? But look at us now. Lovely house in the country. Three lovely children. Yeah. Background noise, background you know, I've been thinking. Noise, I think it's time noise, we moved on. Noise, you know, somewhat bigger. Noise, Come on, you know what I feel about this. No, could you not do that, please? You said to make background noise. Yeah, but don't actually say background noise, background like that. Just talk normally. Oh, sorry. OK, let's go again, then. Keep it going. Two, three, action. Well, look at us now. A lovely house in the country. Three lovely children. Yes. There was this nutter on the tube and he started yeah. stabbing people. At first, everyone thought it was normal. Cut! Look, you're just an extra. Do you understand? Like background scenery. Right, I see. Yes. So keep it low. Like what, like this? There was this nutter on the tube and he was a nutter yeah, and he started stabbing... It's too loud. There was this nutter on the tube and he started stabbing people. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's better. But can you not say that nutter thing, please? I know, I'm adding a bit of interest. Well, you're not supposed to be interesting. You're just an extra. OK. All right. And what should I say? Anything. Now, I can't think of anything. Look, just take that and pretend you're reading it, OK, to your wife here. OK. I'm sorry, darling. Can we go one more time? This really will be it. Two, three, keep it going. Action! Seems like only yesterday. I know. Where does the time go? <laughs> yeah, look at us now. Look at us now. A lovely house in the country. Lovely house in the country. Three lovely children. Three lovely children. <laughs> Maybe we should Maybe move we should. on. Cut! Now oh, listen, you. Get off. And when you come back, just keep quiet. Sit there, shut up, and be quiet. Right, I won't say a word. Still recording. Action. It seems like only yesterday. I know. Where does the time go? <laughs> but look at us now. <laughs> With a new Big Money Psychological Quiz Show starting tomorrow night, Robert Kilroy Silk presents Shafted at 8.30 Monday night. Next tonight, though, Lisa Riley brings us more howlers in New You've Been Framed. What have you got? Got a mobile. Bring your work home with you. <laughs> oh, I really don't have the shoes for this. <laughs> Hang on. Excuse me, did you phone us? Did you phone us? Did you phone us? Oh, you're the breakdown service. Sorry, yes, I did phone. It sounds like something metal's rattling round inside the engine. <laughs> what are you on about? Well, are you going to look under the bonnet? What do you mean, the bonnet? The big thing at the front. Is this your first day? <laughs> There's nothing there. Well, you won't know till you've looked, will you? Are you feeling okay, sir? I'm a fully paid up member, you know. <laughs> okay, I'll have a little look for you. Oh, look. There's a spanner in there. Let's have a look. I can't see. <laughs> oh, yeah, I've been looking for that. <laughs> Enjoy the rest of your journey, sir. Oi! Right. Spanner. <laughs> Excuse me, it won't stop. Look. <laughs> <laughs> That's 
just your shoe making a funny noise with your mouth. <laughs> there's nothing I can do for you. So there's no way you can get this car to start? No! Well, you know what that means, don't you? I'm a Premier member. You have to take me home. Carlisle, please. <laughs> Who are you calling Egghead? No, oh, not you. Him. <laughs> oh, God. I know I ain't no great success story. Look at me. What am I, a tubby private dick who spends half his time dodging a bullet, the other half dodging a law? Yeah, sure. I ain't no superhero. OK, so I smoke too many cigarettes and I drink too much bourbon. And you stink. OK, so I ain't no bather. I can't afford fancy cologne or a fancy place to live. But I do have a place, a place in my heart, and that place is for you. Yeah, sure. I ain't no great shakes. I haven't got much money and I don't have the fancy car. And you're ugly. OK, so I don't look like a movie star and a guy I know are all bums. So I spend too much time in a speakeasy with a low lives and a mob. But I love you, doll, and that's got to count for something. Ain't it? Ain't it? Yeah, sure. If I was you, I'd walk away. I know what I am. A guy would have the fancy shoes and the fancy looks. And you wet the bed. OK, so I squirt a little. But I'll tell you something, I love you, doll. And that's got to count for something. Some cheese. Yeah, go on, have some cheese, yeah. Onions. Yeah, go on, have some onions, yeah. There you go. Thanks a lot. You busy? Nah. Do you want to blow my whistle? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, can you hear me? Yeah. yeah. Now, you know why we're here today, don't you? Your voice will be an integral part of our overall improvement of the London Underground. So let's make a start, shall we? You should find the script in front of you. Yes, I've got it, thanks. I'll guide you through it, but mm -hmm. any problems, let me know. I think you should find it's fairly straightforward. OK. So here's the first one. Finchley. Finchley. A bit more bold and definite, if you will. Finchley. Excellent. So let's do all the Finchleys now. East. East. West. West. And Central. Central. Now, if you could just give me Clapham, North, South. Clapham, North, South. Common. Common. Tart. 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 <laughs> Very good. Now, if you could just say, this train terminates at... This train terminates at... Morden. Morden. High Barnet. High Barnet. Edgware. Edgware. Spreadham. Spre Spreadham. <laughs> it's very definite on that one. It's the end of the line. Spreadham. That's more like it. I haven't heard of that station. OK, yet. moving on. <laughs> Let's see you say, this train is for... This train is for... Elephant and soapy lava. <laughs> Elephant and soapy lava. I can't say that. It's fine. It sounded good. <laughs> now, wood green. If you could emphasise the w on that. Wood green. Bank. Bank. A bit more on the ank. Ank. <laughs> Upminster. Can you stress the up? Upminster. The Oval. The Oval. Arsenal. Arsenal. I'm not sure about this. We're on the home stretch now. Hackney Wick. Hackney Wick. Shepherd's Bush. Shepherd's Bush. <laughs> Just one more thing. Cockfosters. <laughs> it's on the Piccadilly line. Mmm, <laughs> this looks yummy. You're gonna make Mummy proud and have a nice big spoonful. Are you aware you were doing 40 miles an hour in a 30 mile an hour limit, sir? It's my job. <laughs> <laughs> It sounds like something metal's rattling round inside the engine. <laughs> what are you on about? Well, are you going to look under the bonnet? What do you mean, the bonnet? The big thing at the front. Is this your first day? <laughs> There's nothing there. Well, you won't know till you've looked, will you? Are you feeling OK, sir? I'm a fully paid-up member, you know. <laughs> OK, I'll have a little look for you. Oh, look. There's a spanner in there. Let's have a look. Can't see. <laughs> oh, yeah, I've been looking for that. <laughs> Enjoy the rest of your journey, sir. Oi! Right. Spanner. <laughs> Excuse me, it won't stop. Look. <laughs> <laughs> That's just 
a shoe making a funny noise with your mouth. <laughs> There's nothing I can do for you. So there's no way you can get this car to start? No! Well, you know what that means, don't you? I'm a Premier member. You have to take me home. Carlisle, please. <laughs> <laughs> Oi! Egghead! Who are you calling Egghead? No, not you. Him. I know I ain't no great success story. Look at me. What am I, a Toby private dick who spends half his time dodging a bullet, the other half dodging a law? Yeah, sure. I ain't no superhero. OK, so I smoke too many cigarettes and I drink too much bourbon. And you stink. OK, so I ain't no bather. I can't afford fancy cologne or a fancy place to live. But I do have a place, a place in my heart, and that place is for you. Yeah, sure. I ain't no great shakes. I haven't got much money and I don't have the fancy car. And you're ugly. OK, so I don't look like a movie star and a guy I know are all bums. So I spend too much time in a speakeasy with a low lives and a mob. But I love you, doll, and that's got to count for something. Ain't it? Ain't it? Yeah, sure. If I was you, I'd walk away. I know what I am. A guy would have the fancy shoes and the fancy looks. And you wet the bed. OK, so I squirt a little. But I'll tell you something, I love you, doll, and that's got to count for something. If I was you, I'd walk away. I know that, but I'm telling you something, doll. you got to know this. I love you like a guy never loved a woman before. Yeah, sure, I'm not a poet. I don't speak like a guy with all the fancy words. And you at sex. Oh, why don't you get stuffed? <laughs> the end. There we go. Finally finished. OK. Let's have a look, then. Ooh. Black satin sheets. Oh, come on, Karen, show some imagination. A lot of people like that. It's very romantic. If you say so. Ceiling mirrors. What? Tacky. Oh, God, give me a break. Read on. OK. Leopard skin rug. I know what I like. Oh, Karen, nobody's going to get this. Shut up, will you? That took me ages to finish, and you've just picked it to pieces. I just think you should get a boyfriend before you write your... Holy! <laughs> hey, your helmet. Absolutely hopeless with computers. I'm, I'm totally clueless. I wouldn't know a website if it got up and smacked me in the face. I know exactly what you mean. I know. I'm the same with video recorders. Oh, I cannot program worse. one to save my life. Uh, video recorders? I can't even barely turn my TV on. Oh, you're lucky I can't even find my telly. <laughs> it's pitch black in my house. I can't use light switches. I don't know how they work. Oh, no. You're lucky you can get into your house. I'm terrible with keys. I've oh, never got the hang of them. I never. Uh, I'm the same. I like? can't even find my house. I, don't, oh, I can't use numbers. So how's that all work, then? What's like? that about? What we oh, like? oh. <laughs> <laughs> Drinking. Oh. I never, never got the hang of it. No, I couldn't really remember. Oh, 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 oh,
gin. I see you're admiring my butterfly collection. Collection? We've only got one. Well, it's actually harder than it looks, stabbing a butterfly with a pin. <laughs> I can't go. Sorry? I can't go with someone standing next to me. I'll be finished in a minute. Oh, hang on. I think I'm going now. <laughs> yep. Yes, I am. Oh. Good. Oh, dear, I've stopped. Can you come back, please? <laughs> Just can you come back and stand next to me? Only I think strange it was having you there that made me go. <laughs> Lovely weather. Right. <laughs> Nearly done. There. Oh dear, hang on. I think I need a poo. What time's this new boss of yours getting here? Should be here in a minute. Hey, what's she like? You know the type. No coat, fur knickers. <laughs> the expression is, fur coat, no knickers. <laughs> Thank you for calling. Your call is being held in a queue and will be answered shortly. of Her Majesty's Customs? Yes. Where from the CID? We've reason to believe you've been pilfering from the airport. I don't know what you're talking about. you better come in. <laughs> Turn over and action! And then you said those four magic words, will you marry me? I just couldn't believe it. I remember the look on your face. I thought you were going to faint. It seems like yesterday. I know. Where does the time go? But look at us now. A lovely house in the country. Three lovely children. Yeah. Background noise, background noise. You know, I've been thinking. Noise, I think it's time we moved on. You know, somewhere bigger. Come on, you know what I feel about this. <laughs> <laughs> 